We are here. What you got me? You just got bars. Season two. Got my peoples over here. What you get me? Hey, right, pick up your thing though. It says creations, you know, look out for me on the ground, you know, LinkedIn. 2021 to my year, you see me. <laughs> <laughs> my guy Jaden, you yeah. get me? Yeah, the realist. Yeah. He's gonna do it there in the first season, he's got bars, you feel me? <laughs> I don't have bars. Huh? I don't have bars. <laughs> if we slide over here, we've got the man himself. What the fuck are you doing back there, bro? What do you mean, bro? What are you doing back there, fam? You say it, now, let me get a drink. Come on, bartender, man. What are you saying, bro? I don't know if I can touch these and that. Nah, don't even, don't even try it, bro. Before, before man, man's deposit's gone and that. <laughs> you don't like that? Um... People have been asking for season two for time, I'll be real with you, but the way I do Who's Got Bars is like... I have to believe in the artist, you know what I'm saying? So for a while, there wasn't many artists that man really believed in. Even this season, why it's taken so long, it's obviously part of it is me having the inspiration to actually make the beats. Part of it is COVID. Part of it is me being at the studio for like four or five months while this was being um, renovated and all of these things. But another part is just me finding the artist and listening to the artist and finding that, yeah, I think you're gonna be next. Yeah, I think you're cold. I like your music, do you know what I'm saying? It's not just about who's up and coming and who's got the numbers, it's about raw, like, do I really fuck with them, innit? And I feel like every artist on who's got bars this season, if you go back to my reactions to them, you can tell that I really fuck with them, do you get what I'm saying? I feel like, obviously it feels different because I feel like the series is established, doesn't it? So I feel like going into it is not like, before it was like, for me, I was thinking, okay, how are people, how are people gonna, like take this, you know what I'm saying? How are they gonna take it in? But now it's like people are waiting for it. Do you know what I'm saying? This is a bit different. What's going on here? You get me? This is the most anticipated season two of Who's Got Bars. Yeah. You get me? Nice of TP. Behind the camera, we've got the man himself, the most efficient guy in the drill scene. Man like Prod by Walks. Bro, you actually showing my love. Come on, man. The best thing we do, you get me? It's here yeah. right now. About to get started. Let me plug myself. If you want to yeah. find me, you get me. TP Films underscore on the Instagram. You get me on YouTube. You can follow my thing, Mr. TP. We've got BTS over there. We're going to have some other videos. We're going to have all types of stuff. You get me? What we got? Anyway, we got, um, you say Tutorial videos. <laughs> <laughs> Um, me, it says creation. <laughs> yeah, that's my brother TP. He likes to take over the camera. As you can see, as you can see, he likes to take it over. So we have done the first mix, and we are on to second mix. This is Gully's version, and it's so limitless mixing. You get me? The ugliest. Right to J House. Kakarot in the building. I beg you, dye it blonde, please. <laughs> Super <laughs> Saiyan. Nah, you know, <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! Oh shit! Ultimate instinct. Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> Ultra instinct, bro. He he has no no clue about Dragon Ball Z or Super, but Ultra Instinct Goku's right here, isn't it? <laughs> Much, um, there isn't much to it still. There's there's other bits like the um, because like, I don't feel like I need too much of the bass, bro. I no, no, no there isn't. The right level. It's just like the string phrase, the chorus, work, yeah, stuff yeah, like yeah, that. Yeah. That's the only things that's left. The other, other one was like a lot, a lot of a lot going on. Yeah, yeah, this one isn't that. But this is kind of like, yeah, straightforward. 
He died, so it must have been fake. Swing, swim, got him wet like lake, lake. They know he won't be like lakes. I don't know why they're playing their lives like lake. If man come with a show like lake, then a man try and go like lake. Circle around the state. If my square was still in the state. I didn't know about Gaddy. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Until I done this YouTube bars. I didn't know about Gaddy. Didn't know about him like that at all. And then when I heard it, I was like, yo, this guy's hard. You get me? And I started hearing him more, like, obviously he started doing his thing, he started bubbling more. You get what I'm saying? Like, so that's one thing I wanna say. You definitely put me into Gully, 100 percent But to, now for me to say that, yeah, you get me, I've engineered one of his one of his freestyles. Yeah, it's sick man. It's sick bro. You see Gully, I first heard of him in local politics with Crankface, and when I heard it, like, this is before he started to inject the energy into his songs and all these type of things. And obviously we have PS, we have Karma, we have Crankface that's out of the Peckham lot, you get what I'm saying? Snooping these things. So I was just seeing him like, thinking, he's good, but he's not Crankface, he's not PS and that. You know what I'm saying? Not Karma and that. And then his light work freestyle came out and I took that in and I was just like, yeah, he's, 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 this is something. This is what I need to hear. And then, obviously, Say So Demon Time came out and I was rating that a lot. And then he, Say So dropped another song and we reacted to that song. It was like, it's all right. Is how how dare you dare or something like that on stream they were like nah check out uh golly video vixen it's on the same beat bro i lost my mind <laughs> i lost my mind when i heard that one there still i can't go on the playlist surely it can because of the beat surely it can because of... golly's used the beat oh oh we might have to come back to this rating is that the video vixen song let me know if this is a video vixen song it is oh should we do oh now nah, this ain't cindy say so by the way so how about i push golly's one ne like next how about I push Gully's one next and then we can say who did the better job. Yeah, you look on that, cool. One of the maze is cool now offer. Why would I wanna chase my light whiskey? Man can't wait till I catch me. I don't make <sighs> To this day, it's one of my um my favourite Gully songs, do you get what I'm saying? If not my favourite Gully song. Too many talk about schools, cause we're still in the lead. If I back this, back this, slap this, I'm trying to say I'm what you saying, Gali, man? Nothing, man. We say we live. Yeah, man. It's a take me in. Come on, man. You know what the fuck it is. Gunpowder. Trust me. <laughs> yeah, then when it's ready to spit, jump up in it and walk to the mic. Not yet, not till you're ready to spit. He's just raw, like with it. Do you know what I'm saying? Like his energy could just get you gas. Like even when I'm editing it, I'm editing that shit. Yo, yo, <laughs> <laughs> I'm listening to that shit. I'm editing it with Vim, bro. Like I'm like, yo, this guy's got it. Ah, all of them, it's got the most character. Mm -hmm. That's what I would say. It's got the most character. Like even with the I'm in common, you know when Gully does Gully, man, his ad libs. It's just, it's just. Do you know what it is? It's smoke, yeah. But it sounds like fun drill. You okay, know, yeah. You know what I mean? Like, my man's just having fun with it. Like, you get me? It's still smoky settings, though, but he's enjoying himself, innit? He died, so it must have been fake. Sweet, sweet, but it went like lake, lake. They know we got cool like fakes. I don't know why they're putting their lives at stake. If man come with a snort like vape, tell that man try and I'm cool like shit. Circle that round state. If I swear up, then it all get fake. And it feels so great when you get one and then both don't take. But three of them, two of them scattered, but we got one that's all that matters and matters. And it's whack got ammo, see a man's brain when I snap man's barrel. Hold to the water, 
the shadow, I tear man, try put hands in trouble. Yo, yo, bring this thing off, push that in off, bring that spin off. He went against the grain, but he weren't the same when he scored that trigger. Try to spill a man's juice, big off, do it, bro, laugh, don't do it on tour. Do it, bro, laugh, don't do it on socials. Think that, but I made that cool. I remember doing a pod at the old studio, and then Lee inspired me in it, like, just to get Who's Got Bars season two done. And I was like, thinking of artists that man really believe in, and Gully was one of them. I hit him up, like, yo, Who's Got Bars season two, you down? Mum was like, yeah, where are you? I'm like, I'm at the studio. He's like, fam, I'll pull up right now. You get me? You sent him the beat pack. He's listening on the way. You picked the beat that you heard today. Do you get me? It's one of the beats I like, I can't lie, but it is an old beat, which is why halfway through, like, I was like, oh, I've got better as a producer now. Like, I'm, I'm, I like a different type of sound, do you get me? So let me change the beat. And obviously, I gave it a more melodic instrumental, showed it to a couple of people, do you get me? And we, they were torn. Some people were saying both beats are cold, but the first beat suits it more. Mr. Reload, it was like, fam, the second beat is more like more experimental, it's more developmental, do you get what I'm saying? It, it, it can give Gali a different angle. You know what I'm saying? So I played it on the stream. I played the instrumental on stream. You get me? The second instrumental on stream, everybody loved it. And then the next week or a couple weeks later, I played the one with the vocals on both beats and they chose the original beat. So we stuck with that. Do you get me? But that's just me being picky and thinking raw. Sometimes letting the fans get to my head a little bit like on the instrumental side of things and just, you know, tweaking a little bit too much. I do that a lot. I've heard the change in artists, I'm very good at listening to what is happening and trends across the scene. And I've heard, and you've heard it as well. You've heard it in ad libs. You've heard it in the way people are saying things. I've heard that certain videos I've seen recently as well. I'm just like, yeah, that's a gully saying. That's, you know, I haven't brought it up. It's like, you know, some people touch the scene. It's like, okay, we all saw the Queng face plugged in, right? or even petrol station. Do you know what I mean? That's the brother's impact. That's Gully's impact on the scene. Do you get what I'm saying? And Queng Face, if you talk about drill, is top fucking tier. And for an artist of top tier stature to, do you know what I mean? You see Gully, that's a brother I believe in, bro. You know, pause, if Gully farts in the wind, people are gonna listen to it and say it's a banger, you know, like that. You get what I'm saying? So, listen. But yeah, you pulled up to um the session, you get me, Lee was still there. He was telling us, this is a week before Ying that came out when he pulled up to record it. And I can't lie, I've just been taking long to drop it because I wanted everything, every episode to be done before we dropped Who's Got Bars because of the troubles that we had season one. But there has to be a balance because I can't leave stuff that long. You get me? I've got to start overthinking of these things. But I still love Gully Street Star to this day. I still have the same energy. I still dance to it. Man, I still rap along with the lyrics. You get me? Like, man, we'll have it on repeat 20 times before I change the song. And I can do that every day. Thank you.